What's up guys, this is your boy Rusian with another Hitchhiker's Guide to Raid Shadow Legends, episode 9, can't believe that. <laughs> anyway, so, as of yesterday, we were kind of right behind the magic, we passed, we're finally got the potion I needed, passed magic, and that's where we stand. I spent hours last night and part of this morning getting all the food I needed. Pretty much I have no other champions, I, I only have my main champions right now and everything else was garbage, okay? But anyway, I was able to get my champion to level 60! First one! And I'm gonna get stuck in the next one. <laughs> Reach Silver 2, like, like I said, you guys have to keep like every day, hit a few. Now, that's why it's good to look forward. So you have an idea if there's anything coming up that requires you to, I don't know, kill 200 champions in the arena or something like that, right? Uh, so just look forward if there's nothing, go at least 5, get down to 5, let it go up to 10, take 5 again, make sure to use all the refills you have for the arena because, I mean, not the ones that are like 9-9 nine, nine days, but basically you have some that are only 24 hours. Uh, so use them up, make sure you don't waste that because later on, it will have a lot of impact uh, for you guys to be able to get the Arbiter. Okay, so clear stage seven of Catacombs of Nar Book on Bruto, done. Now clear stage 10 or higher of the Minotaur Labyrinth, 10 times on auto. Okay, so I'm not going to do that with you guys. Uh, let's just talk about the following missions. I think it makes more sense at, at this point. So, unlock tier 4, masteries. Uh, so, it's for two chan. Oh, for one. So, if you guys know, if you were following the way uh, I explained to you guys, you guys use your gems as soon as you got about 800 to be able to unlock the masteries to one of them. Uh, I actually unlocked to two. Uh, of my champions so this done three stars on stage seven of catacombs of Narbuk. also done win then five or six uh this coming up pretty easy shouldn't be a problem if you guys have any issues uh if you're on stage 10 uh what you probably have to do at this point is really look at your gear now if you do have your level 60 and he has his masteries at least, and mostly if that's your main one, like Kael, uh, you should be able to clear, no problem. Uh, the other ones will just support the damage. So this shouldn't be a problem. Then the next one is what may get us stuck. So basically uh, the problem we're gonna have in here is get two rank six champions, right? So I just use everything I had to be able to get my my first one. Now, I do have some resourcing here. Let's take a look. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, so I do have a hair here. Oh yeah, no, I, but, okay, I digress. I also worked on some stuff through the day before I record the video trying to get to it. So, I do probably have close to enough, right? So Marksman, this guy is in the beam. I gonna feed him. Uh, my boy here, by the way, Lazaire or Lazare, he's good. I'm beating, <laughs> so I was beating a couple of things without any gear on this guy. So I guarantee you with gear, mm, amazing. The most, his affinity is pretty good. So yeah, uh, invest on this guy, but that being said, I have one more, right? Sure, I could try to get four and get at least fuse then into uh, the hyena one. Forgot the name, just saying. But anyway, so I could do that, but as of right now, if I'm trying to close, you know, close this thing by tonight, yeah, I have to feed those. So, uh, but I am keeping one. So pretty much right now I have, for the most part, I have food. 
It's the same thing. Apothecary, love this guy. Do not feed him unless you really have to. Uh, there's always a chance I will actually get... Um, Ooh, what's your name, boy? All right, Jailer. So, Ogre and Jailer really like him. Don't want to feed him, but I guess a pot carry is better. So, I may actually just give him 10 levels and feed him instead. I'm still deciding. It's going to be a last minute decision. So, anywho, uh, starting to build food. Just as sore, I'm not feeding him. Uh, it's not like it would be hard right now that I already did the fusion to get all those champions, uh, but I, I, I uh, he pained me, okay? So I'm probably keeping him. It's gonna be the whole like, well, if I have to choose about not being able to go past the point I am on those missions. Oh yeah, you're dirt. But if not the case, I will probably save him up. Anywho, let's keep going. So I am getting food right now. Uh, I will be getting some energy from mission. So I shouldn't really have a problem by doing that tonight. Um, now the biggest question is, what if you don't? Or what if you, when you arrived at this point of the mission, uh, the missions, you don't have the right affinity? And you probably think, well, but yeah, but this one comes right after magic. Well, not true because Depending on the week, uh, it may hit around the weekend. So you're going to have voids on Sunday. And it may mess up everything. Anywho, anywho. Let's get to the point. Uh, if this happens. Or if you can't make the fusion. If you can't make uh, to get the 6 star. Right? You're stuck. So it's going to take at least 4 days. For you to be able to. Excuse me. For you to be able to go and progress to the next step. Uh, what you have to start doing is, like I always say, look forward. Look forward in your life, too. It's going to help you. I swear. Anyhow, so you're going to be have like, for example, this. Defeat 75 champions on Classic Arena. You cannot do anything about it. But, at least ahead of time. But what you can do is, later on, you're going to have to get... Um, some of your bonuses up. So pretty much right here, three, boom. Don't have four yet. Try to get those things up as much as you can. I believe the, haven't looked forward, not far enough, but four is one of them. After that, it's probably gonna require you to have two or four. So you need to start working on those things. You need to start looking forward. Don't waste your time. Or oh, and also, the other thing you can do, if you have three days to burn until you can get to the next part, right, of the Arbiter missions, level food. Level food, clear content, get more of your champions to level 60, uh, everything else. Because basically, if you get more guys to level 60, it's easier for you to be able to clear content, it's able to you to when you actually get to that point on the Arbiter missions, you're not struggling to clear stage 10, stage 15, or whatever stage it's required to, all right? Work on the challenges. Uh, sometimes they will really destroy your mind because you'll just be running, trying to get like, I don't know, gauntlets with uh, attack percentage for five hours. Same problem with fusions. Uh, so that can be a problem, sure. But, just run them. Not all the time. Run a cup of them. Do your quest. Do your dailies every day. Every day coming here, beat a champion boss, three champion campaign boss three times. Do them. So you get, after one week running, you get an ancient chart. And, also a month running, you get a void chart and you get an, Jesus, sacred chart. So, pretty much start running this. Don't forget to run your clan boss missions as well. I mean, run clan boss, Demon Lord. So yeah, guys, uh, the only time, before you, but 
also, uh, before you run Demon Lord, uh, just make sure, as always, that you don't have a mission coming up. Like, if you have to wait like a couple of days to the keep to open, you don't have to worry about it. Uh, but just make sure there's not coming up. Also, because some of them require a lot of points, and if you don't have your champions in a certain level or powerful enough, you may need like three to four keys to be able to clear. And you do, you will have enough. Uh, you can clear with pretty much like five keys in one day, six keys in one day. If you save two from the night before and then run the two, every six hours you get a new one. So not six, but like five. You may have to do that to clear some clan boss, depending on how fast you're running this account. So anyway, make sure to look forward. Let me know in the comments where you guys are at in the Arbor missions. Let me know how long it took. Let me know if that's helping you. <laughs> and by the way, I'm saying that because people actually messaged me and said, wow, it really helped me to be able to progress. And I feel very happy and very excited to hear that. So just let me know in the comments. Give me a like, dislike, let me know um, how you guys feel about this video. And I look forward for the next style of videos I'm gonna make too. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the game.